welcome back to the TNP server. And as you can see right behind me, the TNP arena that I've been building on for the past, I would say about two weeks, has finally been finished. This place is monstrous. It's probably taken me about 10,000 blocks of concrete, not to mention probably about double that in paint and then the bulletproof glass i don't even want to know how much lead i had to smelt to in order to do that but it is finally finally complete but that's all i'm good showing you from this side but let me give you a little bit of a tour so starting with the east side as you can see here we have full glass like open area to allow the light going through and then we have two entrances one on either side here we we'll can call them gates if you like and then we just have the tnp arena uh, signage at the top above there is uh, basically just empty rooms here but those actually lead into the control room which i will show you a little bit later so moving on to the west side the west side looks kind of similar to the other side but as you can see here that at the top there is no other rooms here there's no control room this is just basically mainly for spectators entry so it's just purely a big wide open space so if we go in here as you can see we have a large open space leading up to a nice clock telling you the time and when you go up the stairs it leads into the arena itself and uh, the arena we just have like concrete seating no actual normal seating or you know like chair seating just concrete seats and you can just walk up to the seats by the stairs right here and as you can see from here, you have a full view of the whole entire arena. If we back, go back over to the east side, you can see here there is a little kind of, uh, what was it called, mezzanine floor here. If we go up the stairs here, this all leads into the kind of, almost like a commentator's box, but it's more like a control room. From here, you can have access to the view here. And then also, if I just turn my UI on, I've added these switches. And if you look over there, there's a garage door and I've managed to hook it up so that the garage doors open from the control room. So whoever is the controller for the particular day, they have access to let people in and out. So yeah, this is the control room. And then if we go to the side here, this is kind of like, I don't know, you could call it the VIP box if you like. You can just see people from a lot higher. You know, you don't want to mix with all the peasants over there. You want to look at the arena yourself, right? In your own little private box. But yes, this is the TNP arena. Finally, finally finished after about a fortnight's worth of building. Even like the gravel took so long to build as well. But I'm glad to say it's finally finished. And I can't wait to test this bad boy out with the guys. And bring them all back onto the server for a PvP tournament. Because I feel like everybody is itching to kind of shoot each other. And what better excuse than to put it into arena so what do you think guys i think the arena looks amazing and i think also i'm going to try and export it so for you guys at home i'm going to put it onto the nexus mod and then you guys can just download it and put import it into your own worlds whether it's on a server or on your private server but yeah this took quite a long while i exhausted all my resources i literally don't have any concrete left apart from what's on my hot bar right now which is 391 blocks and yeah, I just completely need to kind of unwind now. And what better way to unwind is to basically shoot some zombies. And I already have a quest ready to go. So let's get over to the POI and just blast through the quest. Right then, looks like it's the old mansion. Uh, I, again, I don't remember the layout. I mean, it's quite impossible for me to remember every layout of every single POI. But this should be quite easy now. We're kind of decently high leveled and we have enough bullets i believe for this py do i need to bring out the robotic drone ah we don't need that that's fine we'll just stick that in there we'll just kick start and let's just blast through this this should be pretty pretty simple he says we have greenies though oh are we in greenie territory i did not expect that oh get rid of that guy you're the big guy right there. You know what? This might be a time for me to bust out the uh, the magnum here. Going through here. Around this corner. Anybody around here? No. Okay. Down here. I'm going to shoot that guy in the face. And we're going to shoot that guy in the face. Just like that. And as ever, we'll just go through and um, loot afterwards. After we've cleared the POI. All right. Let's see here. All right. Down we go. Kill that guy. Kill that guy. 
Kill that guy. Okay, Magnum is pretty OP right now. <laughs> Literally deleting everybody. Nobody in there. Interesting. Ready, ready, ready. Got him. <laughs> oh, through here. Okay. Wait, I just came through here. Why is it saying I need to go back down? I am so confused. No, it's through here. That's confusing. Right, out we go. Right, where are you zombies? I'm feeling there's one right there, right? Yeah, one, two, three. That's all of them in there. Nice. Any more? Guess not. Okay, go through here and then we're going to go down. And then let's see. Any zombies in the corner? Any zombies in the back? Hello. Gotcha. Right, through here. Right, I have a feeling there's going to be a few in here, right? Let's have a look. Yep, shoot her there, shoot her there, bomb, oh, there we go, and she is kind of stuck, we'll just help her out there. <laughs> Alright, moving through, blasting through the POI here, going downstairs, hello, oh, Karen, Radman, in the head, that was a brilliant shot, okay, down we go, alright, downstairs, we gotta be careful down here, where are you folks, shh, okay, First thing says, let's just check down here. Make sure there's nothing down here. There isn't. Great. Next. What just happened? I just glitched through. I just glitched through the wall. Unbelievable. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we just going to have to cheese it back into the building. Oh, I can't believe that happened. Right. Where was it? Down this way, through this door, through the garage, up over here, and then down. I can't believe I just glitched through that building. <laughs> All right, down we go. And usually there, yep, yeah, there he is. It's that one guy. There's another one coming through. Are you gonna put your head through? Perfect. Just the way I like it. And then go through here. And I believe, yeah, this is the one where they're gonna have a lot, a lot of zeds coming through. So I'm just gonna do a quick reload here, make sure everything is full up. And then when they come through, we're just gonna mow them all down. But before we do that, let's see if we can. Oh, maybe we can do the sneaky sneaky. Wait, wait, they're not waking up, right? Let's see if we can do this. There's one, two, uh, uh, you know what, screw it. Let's do the whole thing. Hello, all right, line them up, line them up. Two, three, mama coming through, she's angry. Any more? Military guy. And then, bomb. And we are clear. Not bad at all. Agility guns are actually pretty nasty. I'm not gonna lie. So, as ever, let's just see what we get. And before we do anything, I'm gonna pop this eye candy. Because that's gonna boost our game stage too. Where is it now? 126. It's not that high. But, I'll take it. Let's see what we get. So here's what we got, folks. Again, nothing too crazy. We've got some hop seeds recipe, which is kind of nice. We can do some beer at some point. We we'll have a hunting rifle schematic. And then we have some schematics that we already know, which is Tech Junkie, the Bl Temper Blade schematic, Waste Wasteland Treasure Volume 6, and Tech Junkie 1, which does more damage with robotics. And then other than that, we just got some bits and bats. So we've got some extra acid here, some more duct tape, and some more multiples as well. So again, Nothing too crazy right now. Let's just head back to Jen and let's pick up another quest. I really want to get to tier 5 like as soon as possible. So I'm going to rush through these tier 4s. In fact, I am tempted to just finish all the tier 4s and then see what the reward is at the end and then just jump to tier 5. But let's go see what she gives us for this round and hopefully we can get to tier 5 as soon as possible. So we have a tier 5 steel axe and a lever action rifle now i'm not a big fan of the lever action rifle i'll be honest but the flaming arrows uh again flaming arrows are not that great but the motorcycle handlebar i think we'll keep just for the time being just because we can choose that whenever we want so we'll pick that and then we'll pick up another job uh let's see it's getting a little bit late but it's not late enough and also that is really far away 1.1k let's just do the closest one which is this one right here which is the warehouse so let's crack on with doing that and uh yeah let's just see if we can finish some more to get to t5 right then here we are at the warehouse let's just crack this open as soon as possible, let's just start everything off and then... Oh, and also, don't forget to reload. Reload. And yeah, we'll just blitz through this and waste ammo at the same time. I hear... Oh, hello. There you go. Right, downstairs we go. Through here. Quick sharp. Oi. Yep. Hey, you two. You're not dead, are you? Yep. Any more through here? Copper. Ooh, interesting. Right. 
Do a quick reload. I hear people dropping in. What's up, boys? Yo, yo, are you dead? You are dead. Okay. Up we go. Right. Let's just see if we can clear this out. Just like that. He is not dead. Right. Through here. We have two rounds left. We should probably reload. Yeah. Say hi to that guy. These guys. Wakey, wakey. And then, what do we do? We go through out here. Clear this eye off. Is he part of the quest? He is part of the quest. Interesting. Right, through here. Also reload, because we're out of ammo right about now. Shoot that guy in the leg. Shoot that guy in the arm. Boy, and there was two in the corner. Cheeky. Right, round we go. Uh, Toilet. Two. Nice. Speed running this super fast now. Oh, ammo. S2. And then, where do we go? We go upwards. Let's just check around here. Yeah, nothing up here. Round. We go upstairs. No birdies, right? Please tell me there's no birdies. Yeah, there's birdies. There's one. Is that all? Okay. Down we go. Usually, I think there's some doggies somewhere. I, th I think. Hello? All right, let's just use our parkour here. Let's just get right on top of here. Yeah, they're right on the other side. Ah, there we go. There you are. Two dogs. Three dogs. Nice. Back over. Nope. Not today. Where are they breaking through? How do I also need to get back up here? Let's just do this once again. Round here. Up over here. Like so. Round here. Whoop. Hi, Mama. Sorry I missed you. Round we go. Up on the pipe. And they are all where? They're all... Where? Oh, they're all down there. Oh. All right. Come on, round boys. I'll, I'll wait for you. One, two. Let's see. Three. Get this guy. Get this guy. Get this guy. <laughs> and one here. This guy's really confused. Right? And then there is one last area. And they're all around here, right? Don't they all spawn like crazy around here? Oh, he's stuck. Poor fella. Poor fella is stuck in the ground. He's stuck in the ground now. Can you just die? Save, my Save me some time. Nice. We are done. Nice. That was very, very quick. I don't even know how long that took, but it was very, very quick. Right. Let's see what we get then and crack on to the next one. Oh, dear. Guess who I hear? Yep. There she is. Can I? Is she? Oh, she's right there. Lovely. Right in the Hanogin. Nice. Okay. Carry on. So out of all that, we managed to get a fuel saver schematic, which we can use, which is quite nice. And then we just got some like iron chest armor, pumpkin seed schematic, and then again, more acid as well. I remember the time when acid was so rare. Now it's just so easy to get acid now. <laughs> all right. That is done. Next one. Okay, Jen. Tier 6 pickaxe. Ah. I mean, I don't really need it anymore, but I will take this uh, ergonomic grip mod. No, that's always handy for anything, basically. So let's take that. And then, yes, we finally finished it. Tier 4 complete SMG. Oh, contains a bundle. Oh, should we pick this up on the off chance it may be a tier 6? Let's do this. Maybe we'll get a tier 6 SMG. All right. So do you have any special jobs? We don't really care about that. And then we just have to wait for next day so we can do tier 5. But let's crack open this up. Let's see what we get. Unbelievable. Wow. Wow, Jen, you're going to do me like that? Literally level 3? Are you kidding me? Get, get out of here. We don't need that. Oh, that's rubbish. Anyway, tier 4 done. After that ridiculous mess of a reward we're gonna go back home actually rest up now after all that building but we finally finished tier four now i'm so happy now we can get onto tier fives and actually get some proper decent loot or here's hoping anyway but i hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did enjoy this episode make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like button as well and i'll catch you in the record blah 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 bye bye just before I end here, I just want to say I'm really sorry about the lack of in-game audio. Windows decided to do an update and reset all my audio preferences. So when I was recording, it didn't pick up the in-game audio. So I do apologize for that. I have fixed it. So hopefully next time you will be able to hear everything that I hear in-game. So sorry for that. And I'll catch you next time.